day 662 of the Trump administration. It is already clear the pace of news this week is going to be a little different from last. As we come on the air tonight, we're going to begin with some breaking news. Just 21 minutes old, the story has just come out in the past half hour regarding the Trump administration. The Washington Post is reporting President Trump has told advisors he's decided to remove Kirsten Nielsen as Homeland Security Secretary. And her departure, according to the Post, is likely to occur in the coming weeks. Uh, on the phone is one of three bylines who broke this story tonight. Our friend Philip Rucker, the Pulitzer Prize winning White House bureau chief for The Washington Post. Phil, we know this has been a, a long time developing, um, a slow run up. She is an acolyte of uh, General Kelly. But what did this apparently? Well, Brian, the president has just decided, uh, according to officials in the White House, that it's time for her to go. Uh, she is nearing her one year mark on the job. That would be December 6th. But the president told uh, aides over the weekend that he wanted her out uh, very soon. He actually had a trip planned with Secretary Nielsen sometime this week to visit troops at the border in South Texas, and he decided to cancel that trip, uh, according to officials, and uh, has been grumbling about her for months. We've, uh, you know, it's been previously reported that he berated her at a cabinet meeting. He has spoken, uh, you know, poorly about her behind her back, and I think uh, it's time to go. And it's also worth pointing out, Brian, that there's it, this is a little bit mutual. Nielsen has been uh, frustrated in the job herself, uh, and she's been thinking about leaving at some point, although clearly this is going to be the president's decision. Of course, the job could not be more important, among other things, fortifying our electronics grid, fortifying our computers against ongoing and sustained attack from the Russians, among others. Um, and uh, so, Phil, this will be another Senate confirmation of another nominee. It would be. Uh, you know, one, one thing we should point out to the viewers at home, uh, it, just a caveat, that the president will sometimes tell his advisors, his aides, that he's made a decision and then change his mind, uh, you know, once it, once it gets covered in the media. So he could fall back on this. And Chief of Staff John Kelly, who has been Secretary Nielsen's biggest protector in the administration, uh, at this hour is fighting with the president to try to save her job. He's trying to postpone uh, her dismissal. Uh, but we should also point out that Kelly's own future in the administration is considered shaky, uh, with some White House officials saying that he may not be long for this world either. Yeah, it's tough to uh, it's tough to to see how she will want to say uh, want to stay rather looking at some of the language you've reported out uh, uh, from your reporting sources in this story tonight. Uh, Phil Rucker, again, one of three names on the by Line, the Washington Post breaking the story in uh, the last half hour that Kirsten Nielsen uh, is preparing to uh, the president's preparing to remove her as Secretary of Homeland Security. Hey there, I'm Chris Hayes from MSNBC. Thanks for watching MSNBC on YouTube. If you want to keep up to date with the videos we're putting out, you can click subscribe just below me or click over on this list to see lots of other great videos.